Well, Nicole, I decided since I got here a little bit early because you know me, I'm a weirdo, I am going to do a quick video. So off the main road here, when you're pulling onto the property, 8005, um, you can see here is the drive coming through and there is the property. And uh, you know, obviously you got a little tree line that kind of keeps you, keeps you encompassed into this little part of the land here. I don't even know if that's the right word. That's a stupid ass word, sorry. But either way, here we go. You also have a nice little, uh, outbuilding here and potential for driveways everywhere this is pretty cool so i am going to go in give you a little heads up and then All right so as i get out of the car here um you can kind of see back and back over to the main road there where you come in it's got a big tree falling in the middle over this little bit of lane here and again it uh pretty much covers the entire acre and a half which is kind of cool so uh got your own little piece of heaven out here in Carlisle. So let's see the place itself. It's got wood and some gravel heading up. Uh looks like something's been digging down here. Definitely gonna need some work, but it's a cool looks like it's got some cool bones. Big old glass window in the front. Doesn't look to be too damaged or nutty here. Got a side, good chimney, fireplace. Let's see here. I think on the outside actually looks pretty sound. I mean, there's, you see, obviously it's gonna need a little bit of work. Some windows. Let's go around the back side here. Back part of the property. Go here. Oh, look at this. Boom. That's a little bit creepy and cool. Same time. Propane tank, back part of the yard. Looks like you've got some trails and stuff to kind of head out. It's kind of nice. And then you've had some uh, jackass um, right on the side here. My assumption is gangbangers and idiots. But anyway, that's it for right there. Okay, well, it looks like some jackass tried to either kick in the door and or somebody tried to chew their way through. Boom. Here we go. Right when you open up, you come straight into the kitchen. All right, with beams, all this all through. It's a very, very spacious cabin. Uh, sink looks decent, of course. I did say in the details that... Uh, Oh, it open. Yep, yeah, it's a regular cabin. These are old school kind of you know, log cabin cabinets. It's pretty sweet. It's got a lot of room. Um, but it did say that the plumbing, uh, they don't have any pressure. So as you can see, there's some stairs leading up to this loft that's right above here. So that can be sort of a bedroom, obviously. Um, I don't know if I need to go all the way up there, but, you know, well, I will probably in just a second. There's the steps. Then you come back here and you've got a little storage under the stairs. Here is the bathroom, which obviously can use a little work, but you've got all the equipment in here, which my assumption is, of course, you're going to have to redo a lot of this. Unless you got a little door here, uh, locked up pretty well, side entrance. And then here is a bedroom, which is going to need some work. Has a slight musty smell, but it's not terrible. Nothing crazy. Definitely not some as bad as some of the places that Nicole and I have seen. Um, yeah, so that's about it in a nutshell. Uh, well, this is pretty sharp, man. I think if you get this and you're an outdoorsy type cat, this is where it's at, man. This is wicked. Oh, even cooler. Glad I came up here. So you've got this loft over the area, ha! Huh. And then, come back here, there's another bathroom. No, no lights, of course. Uh, let me see here, I don't think I can do anything about that right now. And then another bedroom with a closet. Two closets. All right, well, that's pretty wicked, man. Sorry I can't give you a little more light in here. A lot cooler. Cool. Okay. Actually, I was wrong on one thing. They do have an extra building out here. 
that somebody knocked the damn lock off of because they wanted to see if there was something in here. Freaking kids suck. Except for mine, of course. He's awesome. Uh, and then you also have this building, which is the one I initially thought was the only one here. Let's see if a key works for Pretty damn good size garage, man. Awesome. Looky, looky. All right, so you know. Well, hey, that was a real quick down and dirty tour for you, uh, just so you could take a quick look since they do have the deadline for the uh, uh, best and highest offer by 12 o'clock today. So if you have any questions or concerns, talk to Nicole or myself, and I'd love to help you out. Have a good day.